Project Power stars Joseph Gordon Levitt, Jamie Foxx, Dominique Fishback, and is directed by Henry Juice and Errol Shulman. And in this movie, a former soldier teams up with a cop to find the source behind a dangerous pill that provides temporary superpowers for five minutes. And you get any superhero human ability. And we also follow a man's quest to rescue his daughter from the sinister forces behind the drug while assisting new allies. Now, when it comes to this type of movie, this this had an interesting concept. And plus, this is written by Matt and Tomlin. And the direct two directors, I very much like the direction style, especially Nerve. I think that's an underrated movie from the last decade. But going into this, this is another one of the big budget movies that Netflix has done. But I will say that the best thing about this movie is its concept. The concept it is pretty much a 90s film, superhero, 90s to early 2000s superhero film. But it knows what it does. It doesn't try to be too serious. It doesn't try to be too too depressing. It pretty much knows what it is. A fun, entertaining movie. And that is what I got out of this movie. It was a fun, entertaining movie. Now, it definitely has problems when it comes to the writing. And when it comes to some of the creative decisions in this movie. As far as some of the characterization goes. I feel like some of the characterization and some of the writing is not the most strongest. But I will say Max and Tomlin, he does a decent enough job of using his concept to his advantage. Even if the, to the, the characters have superheroes hit powers for five minutes. Also, I will say that the acting is good in this movie. Jamie Foxx, Joseph Gordon-Levitt, Corny B. Vince, Dominique Fishback, all the performances in this movie are very good. Even surprisingly, Machine Gun Kelly, which I thought he was okay in Bird Box. But I will say the acting is very, very nicely handled. I will say the direction in this movie and the effects and for the action scenes that you do get, you do get get pretty enjoyment out of the action scenes. I did enjoy them a lot. And also the cinematography is very well done. And the cinematography is very well executed. And I do love the cinematography that they have in this movie. I do very much enjoy it. And for the one hour and 51 minutes that goes, I very much have fun time with it. Like I said, there were some slow parts in this movie, but there were also some not very interesting. But there was also some pretty good parts in this movie. I will say, if you do have Netflix and you want to check it out, go ahead. But don't don't expect a, a masterpiece. But this is a 90s, 2000s superhero film that I very much enjoy. And with that being said, I, I'm going to give Project Power a highly recommended. So that was my review of Project Power. Let me know in the comments section down below what you guys think of this. Did you like it? Did you hate it? Or something in the middle? All my social media links are description down below. If you want to send money to my channel or you want some fan mode, you can ask me as well. And if you guys are new to the channel, be sure to hit the subscribe button and the bell to get notified when the videos are up. And with that being said, you guys can be cool and join the epitaphs. You guys, see you later.